Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the James Charles and Tati Westbrook feud, basically. And so, um, if you've been on the internet, YouTube, or just social media or any of that, you probably know about the incident between Tati and um, James Charles. And um, so, basically, the whole thing is kind of like stupid. It's just anything like this is usually pretty stupid. This video is stupid, but. I'm just making it for content. I don't know why you're watching it. And um, so basically, she posted a video called Bye Sister, Tati did. And so basically, the video is about um, how James Charles um, worked with a company that was basically um, a rival of Tati's company. And um, so it's like sleep pills but that's not important at all so basically he sponsored them even though he said he would never i guess that's what she claimed and so he claims that he did it just for protection at coachella which if you don't know what coachella is it's basically like a festival that happens like it's like three days long and it's like i think it's maybe two weekends i'm not sure it's I've heard a lot of weird stuff. He's like, he said he wanted to go back for a second weekend, and he said, "Yo, no more lies." And then his second one, and then um, Tati made a video called "The Reason I Did It" or "Why I Did It." Or I can't remember. It's just they have like a really like stupid title. They didn't even put ads in it, but they're making lots of money off it. It's more of like a YouTube feud, and I think it's kind of obvious like why Tati did it to get her sub count up. Obviously, because if you guys don't know. She's at 5.9 million subs and now she's like above 10 million. So she went up like four plus million in like a couple days, which is pretty insane. And um, yeah, it's kind of stupid how she did it. And James Charles lost about 3 million and then he's gamed about 500,000 of it back. So it's, I don't think it's a big deal. Uh, he's still going to get a lot of publicity, probably more than Tati ever will because, you know, he's... He's a gay makeup artist who's a celebrity YouTuber, so you can't really make this stuff up. And plus, he's the first boy to be on the girls' cover. Like, he's the first boy to be a cover girl. Um, I always screw that up. But, um, yeah, so, it's, but, um, she brought up a couple very, very, like, unreasonable things in her video, but stuff people should probably know, and probably for the best, because, um, Hopefully James Charles changes his actions, but it's not what I think is really true because um, she claimed that he basically molests the straight guys and pressures them into um, thinking they're gay when they're actually straight. And so she actually started out with this one guy from Seattle at her birthday dinner. His name was Sam, but so basically um, Sam, James Charles showed his text. And um, so basically, Jim Charles DM'd him, got into his DMs. And so basically, Sam responded back saying, like, because, like, Jim Charles basically was flirting with him. And then basically, Sam um, texted back. And after a couple texts, he stated that he was bi, not straight, not gay, just bi. Which, if you don't know what bi means, which you probably should, it means you're open to doing it with both sexes, like, such as female and male so she basically stated that he was straight and they pressured into him and so that's not true tati made up a lot of stuff in her video i think like uh and then so basically they so there is an incident basically so sam went over to james charles hotel room because his flight got delayed or something like that and so um to watch a movie and then they kissed for basically an hour after the movie, after James Charles asked him if he could um, ki have a kiss, and so, and then he stated out that he was a bad kisser. And I watched the video of the guy saying this, or it was Gage or Sam. I don't know. That's what James Charles called him, Sam, and his username was I am Gage. So I, I'm not sure, but so basically, um, he stated that. Um, he, I was up there for an hour, and he was a really bad kisser, and he giggled about it. So, if you ask me, that doesn't seem very, like, logical. Like, why would you stay there for an hour and then, like, make it, like, oh, it's his fault? That doesn't really make much sense, considering you're probably stronger than James Charles. Not to be mean or anything, but he's basically 
trying to act like a female. So if he's like a regular female doing all his makeup, I doubt he lifts and stuff like that. But he like has like a strict diet and everything. But like, I doubt he like lifts weights or like exercises a bunch. Like, it's just. And plus, I've seen what he looks like. He doesn't look that strong. Like, even if he is a male, but like he's. I thought he was a girl actually the first time I saw him. So, props to him. He's very good at makeup. But, um. If you ask me, like, if you're going to stay up there for an hour making out, that seems pretty gay to me, so, I don't know. He says it's his first time making out with a guy, and I guess you can't really know until you try. Basically, that's where he's coming from, but to try for an hour is kind of just a little much, and like, hey, you're going to say, oh my god, it's his fault, but you know what, you're the one up there for an hour. It's your decision, dude. He, 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 didn't, he didn't pressure you or anything. Which Tati basically stated that he had pressured him. So, um, that's like one of like the four incidents. The others are like really casual and they didn't really lead up to anything. And James Charles even stated in one of his videos, he's a 19 boy who's gay. So 19. And um, he's about to turn 20 as I'm posting this video in about a week. So basically, um... He and he stated in his video that he doesn't get much action, which, if you don't know what that means, it means because he's a gay guy, he doesn't get much action with other gay guys, which, when I mean action, I mean, like, kissy, tongue, and, like, other stuff I'm not going to go into. So, um, and the reason I said tongue is because in both James Charles' video and Gage or Sam's video, um, they're the same person. But they get called different things. I don't get it. Um, they both talked about tongue. So that's really the reason I said tongue. Because they use tongue. Which is a little gross to me. But it is what it is. So um, basically. Um, Tati has said some lies. James Charles has stated out these lies. And basically his sub counts went up about 500,000. It's all stupid. Like. I don't, I want to like, I don't think I could get pressured into being gay, unless it was like money or any of that, and like, even then I would just probably like, give like, I don't know, I probably still want to do it, but um, I wouldn't, I don't think I could get pressured besides money into like, doing it with a gay guy, so it's, plus like, I'm very straight, so I don't get it. But I don't really see James Charles. This is, like, technically not his fault, in my opinion. Um, I think a lot of this was stupid on Tati's part. I think it's more just a money thing, like, for Tati. Because, like, she's been on YouTube for a while. She's She has gained subs, but not that fast, like James Charles or Jeffree Star have. So, um, I'm going to go on Jeffree Star. So, um, basically, Jeffree Star backed her up and, like... She stated, like, that um, he had, like, been talking very bad at her birthday dinner. So, basically, he stated, and Je Jeffrey stated that, yeah, that's the truth. But then he actually made another video apologizing to James Charles after James Charles made his video. So, um, because he basically said sorry for lying um, about, so, basically, um, Tati said that, James Charles had, like, made a lot of inappropriate stuff, done a lot of inappropriate stuff at her party, and she had to respond to all her friends saying sorry about it, and it was a lie. He was just talking about to, um, to Jeffree Star, who's also a gay guy, um, that does a lot of the same stuff that James Charles does, but has, like, a very different way of doing it, and so, um, yeah, it's a little weird, but that's it. Um, so, um... I'll put up the photos of people that have unfollowed James Charles on social media platforms. A lot of people, like, not someone's, but, like, random people that are, like, followed him, have unfollowed him on social media platforms, YouTube, and others. And, um, here's a couple of the famous people. Kylie Jenner, um, she's been in a couple of his videos. Um, obviously, Tati, Jeffree Star, and then also people like, um, who were in his sister group, like the Dolan Twins and Ember Chamberlain. And it's The list goes on and on, but it's it's kind of stupid. I don't know following them when it doesn't make that much sense because they're probably just going to start following him back.